Hello and welcome to Afri's Concept TV, where we give you the latest news, gist and updates. If you are just joining us, kindly click on the subscribe button to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also click on the notification post to be the first person to get an update when we drop it. To all our listeners, we say thank you for always listening to us. And now to the news of today. The headline. Now the Kano Siki political solution is surprising, says Lao Luakonde. Now to the main news. The IPOB leader who is facing terrorism charges has since been in the custody of the Department of State Services, DSS, since mid-2021. Ex-presidential spokesperson Lao Luakonde on Thursday said he is surprised that the embattled leader of the proscribed indigenous people of Biafra Namdi Kano is seeking a political solution to his travails. Akondewu was a guest on Channel's television Sunrise Daily. Said Kano, given his vocal stance on issues, should prove his case in court. I am surprised that he is trying to get a political solution. The former presidential spokesman said, I think Mr. Namdi Kano should be bold enough to check out these things in court. But apparently, he is not. I would have expected him, based on what we know about him, to say, look, let us go to court. Free Kano on Wednesday. Senators from the South is pleaded with President Bola Tinobu to other Kano's release. Led by Senator Enyinaya Baebe, the lawmakers claim that unless Kano is released, the social and economic activities in the South East zone should continue to be stagnant. The senators held a closed-door meeting with the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Latif Fadbemi, where their letter to President Sinubu on the release of Kanu was delivered for onward passage to the presidency. Kanu was rearrested in Kenya mid-2021 by the federal government and brought to the country for trial on terrorism charges. Although he pleaded not guilty to the charges, Justice Binta Anyako of the Federal High Court in Abuja declined to admit him to bail on the grounds that he jumped the earlier one in which Senator Baribe was a surety. Kanu has since been in the custody of Department of State Services, DSS. This Mr. Laulu Akonde, I don't know what he's saying. Has he not been to court before? What, what have they done? Have they released him? They've just kept him there. Somebody in the comment section is saying, do we obey court orders in this country? Help me ask him. Nobody is obeying anybody. Everybody is above the law. They are not obeying court orders. The court has actually granted him bail. Exactly. They have granted him bail, but he is still in DSS custody. So what are we saying? Why, why is he saying that he should go to the court again? They should stop deceiving Nigeria. The same thing so the Indo, Indo did. He has been released already. That is what the Igbo people are fighting about. That you prefer Yoruba and Hausa people to them. Why have you released Ido and you are still holding Namdi Kanu captive? It just doesn't make any sense. Please, my listeners, what do you think? Kindly leave your thoughts in the comment section. And please do not forget to like, to share, and to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you for always listening to us. See you some other time. Bye.